again with another Facebook Live. And today I want to talk about three financial freedom myths that you most likely believe right now. And we want to get rid of these myths so that you totally understand what's at stake in your business and life. So the first myth I want to talk about is that you probably believe right now that if you work hard, the success will come. Well, that is actually not true because you can work all you want. You can work 14 hours a day, 16 hours a day. You can work really, really hard. But no matter what you do, you keep turning in circles. The money doesn't come in. Clients evade you and you're not actually earning the money that you desire. So why does that happen? Well, reason number one is if you're working hard without a strategy, and you're just throwing spaghetti at a wall to you know, see what works in your marketing and your messaging, for example, then how, how do you measure what actually works or not? You need to be able to understand what is working. So it is crucial for you to measure and track and measure your numbers. And what I mean by that is you need to actually understand your um, what like the, the way you market yourself. And let's say you put a, a sales page out there, you're offering a service. You need to understand what sort of traffic you get to that page so you can then optimize the page and make more out of the traffic that you get in the future. But if you're not tracking and measuring your, your, um, your entire marketing and you don't understand what is working and what doesn't work, then how can you improve it? You can't, okay? And a lot of people just don't do that. They, they think it's too hard, they think it's too complicated. And yes, if you don't know what you're doing, of course it's hard and complicated because you don't know. So if you want my help with that, then book yourself a free marketing audit. I'm currently offering a very few marketing audits to people such as yourself in business to help you understand where you're actually leaving money on the table. And you can book yourself an audit by going to my Facebook page, um, booking calendar in the header. At the top of the page, there's a booking button and you can book yourself in to speak with me. OK, and we're going to walk you through what's actually going on in your business right now and what you can do to improve your marketing efforts. OK, so if you just think that you can work hard without tracking and measuring your numbers, you're not going to get financially free. It's just not going to happen because you've got no, um, you've got no uh, pillars. You've got nothing there to measure your success by. And it's much like going on a holiday without a destination. So you're just turning in circles, nothing works, but you don't really know why it's not working. So it's really important for you to start tracking and measuring what you're actually doing in your business so you can attract more of your ideal perfect customers to you. The second myth around financial freedom is that you probably believe that you need millions to be financially free. That's actually not true because you can be financially free just earning several thousand dollars a month. The key to financial freedom is to work out your existing costs. What is it that you're spending every month in your life? It's not just your business, it's your rent, it's your food costs, it's your outgoing, it's your fuel, it's your business costs. Everything that you spend on a monthly basis has to be added up. And to be financially free, you simply have to earn more money than what you're spending. Now, I'm not a millionaire, but I'm actually financially free. OK, I've been location independent for the, lo for, for the last five years. And my husband, John, hasn't worked since 2011, thanks to my business. So I am financially free but I'm not a millionaire because what we're spending is less than what I'm making in my business. And we're traveling the world, right? We're not millionaires, but we're traveling the world. We go on umpteen cruises and we, 
we see a lot a lot of different countries and we have amazing experiences so you don't need to be a millionaire to be financially free but does that mean that i have all the money that i want in my life no because i like more financial security I actually want to earn and grow my business so I earn more, so I have more security. Which brings me to the third myth around financial freedom. The myth is that financial freedom is the end goal. And I can tell you it is not. The end goal is to have time freedom. The end goal is to be able to sleep and earn money while you're sleeping, to be able to scale your business as you're not even working in your business, if that makes sense. And you can do that by um, assembling a team of people around you who are supporting you in your business. But you can also do that by um, developing a course or a program or an offer that you can sell while you are sleeping, while you're tucked up under the covers or while you're playing um, on the beach and diving into the surf on some far exotic location or while you take your kids to Disneyland, you need to be able to sell something where you don't have to be physically present. So instead of exchanging time for money, you exchange your knowledge and your expertise for money. So you cannot do that if you're a service provider. Service allows you to charge high-end money, especially if you're the expert, which is fabulous. But your time is limited, you know? You only have 24 hours every day. So it makes sense that if you want to scale your business, you have to have a type of offer that allows you to sell your expertise without you having to be physically present. So that's my three lies about financial freedom, the mystified. So if you want to be financially free, if you want to have a business that pays you to travel the world, that pays you to be financially free, and you want to have a free audit with me, then book yourself at a, um, a time on my calendar now. I have only limited slots. So if you want, if you really want this, you're serious about your future, about your financial future, book yourself on my calendar at the top of the page and I will talk to you shortly. Until then, have a fabulous time and I will talk to you in tomorrow's video. Bye for now.